it's not yet over, at least according to Embakasi South MP Julius Mawade, whose election was quashed by appellate court judges. The empowered MP has now moved to the Supreme Court to challenge the appellate court's decision. And that was, uh... Kotiku, yama Supreme Court, itamu ya kwamba tunarudia, you know, tunarudia uchaguzi tu kotiare. Lakini kwa sasa baada ya kuapil jana na kupoa uh, kupoa makatasi na ustaili, tunalea kutumia wananchi wa Mbaka South. Hakuna vacuum. Mawade says he was confident of the pending outcome of the Apex Court accusing his challenger, former Embakasi South MP of Malis. Chama changu, mimi ni mwana waipa, na tulishine chichiti na waipa, na tulishine tena na waipa. Na hakuna mtu ambaye anaweza kututulishia. Elsewhere, these years Sabasaba Day celebrations were characterized by calls for justice for victims of police brutality, even as political leaders appeared to have snubbed the event. I do not regret that uh, we do not have, uh, have politicians today in this particular event because the, the leaders today are the youth who are suffering this, uh, this, this violence by the police. We have to condemn history of extrajudicial killing and in memory of the victims who have been able to live in the country of Kenya and the country of Kenya. Nairobi Women Representative Esther Pasaris, leading residents of the city's East Lands area in demonstration to protest against police brutality. Sitaki kuona vijana wanauliwa bure bure. Police kama unataka ku immobilize criminal, shoot the foot. Huh? Immobilize from down. These is Kenya Union of Domestic Hotels, educational institutions, hospitals and allied workers. Albert Njeru hailed democratic reforms in the country since the advent of multi-party politics, even as he supported President Huru Kenyatta's crusade on the war on corruption. Where corruption issues have been announced, let us the government deal with it perpendicularly. It doesn't matter. Whether it is coming from the lowest to the highest, corruption is corruption. Yami. This even is a section of political leaders from Western Kenya called on President Kenyatta to form a commission of inquiry into the influx of contraband sugar in the country. Nice distortion. How are the guy and how are the When the and the government is now pushing for the prioritization of the sugar factories. Mimi nataka ni kuulize, if you are an investor and the industry is being finished through cheap imported sugar, how will you invest in that industry? Na mimi nakubaliana na speaker wa bunge, wana mturi, ya kwamba kamati zile za bunge, they have let down the country very badly. And Mr. Speaker, you should go even further and say charge those MPs all the money they spent on this committee. Sisi tunajua sukari hiko emeleto bangia. Tunajua sukari hiko na, na, na sumu. Na uwa nakuja kutuambia hiyo hakuna sumu, hakuna sukari bangia. Tukazema hii ripoti ni nini? Bogas. Samson Kitavi, Channel 1 News.